What's up? What's up, my homeboys, homegirl, brothers, and sisters? Kelly goes on y'all tonight. Um, I just got more on my mind now. So I talked to my mom about my dad, like berating me and all that crap. Just uh, I was thinking about 50, 60 minutes ago about me not calling uh, grandma on Christmas. But it's like, dude, like we have had a whole lot of. Sh Stuff going on, sorry. Never know, no, no, shit. Yeah, that's right. We had a whole lot of shit going on these past um, few weeks. It's like my auntie and cousin are really getting aggravating. They're literally uh, like about to turn my brain into friggin' mush, dude. As in saying, like, they're really getting on my nerves. As like. My cousin Simone, you know what, fine. Like, she used, she would always keep to herself, like, stay quiet and all that. Never bother any of us. But ever since my auntie got back from Las Vegas, she's literally made these last um, two weeks, or never know, three weeks now, uh, hell for us. So, like, I... Well, you never know. No, no, no. I, I feel a little bit regretful, but not that much. Because, like, number one... Hold up. Let me show you guys, like, what I was talking about earlier. So, you already know... The, I already told y'all the reason why I can't call anybody or do anything, right? Because of this. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, hopefully, this is a good, good shot. But, let me, let, let, let me show you what happens. Hold up. That, that is what I have to deal with all the time. This, so that happened um, a few weeks ago. My phone fell off of my, let's see, the first time I cracked it, I accidentally, it was like underneath like a pile of clothes on the floor and I stepped on it. And so like the crack wasn't even like all that bad. I could still use the phone. But it's like, the second time I dropped it and slid underneath my bed, this happened. This happened. So that's the reason why I pretty much couldn't make a call. It's like, my mom claims that, like, my dad, the only reason that he braved me is because that he was like, that was like his way of clocking out of, like... Because she claims that, you know, he didn't keep his promise about getting me anything for Christmas, you know? It's like, I really want to, it's like, I really want to call my uh, family, like the rest of my family, up on Christmas and wish them a Merry Christmas. But it's like, I'm sorry, but dude, number one, I've had a whole lot of stuff going on around here lately number two I don't have a phone to use if you can see that if like take, like take a good long look take a good long look as to why I cannot call or even pretty much do anything and like check this out hold up let me flip it back over cause let me show you guys like what happens See, that's the reason why I pretty much can't do anything. That is why, ladies and gentlemen, that is why. It's like, my God, I'm sorry that I didn't, like, call you guys and wish you all a Merry Christmas, but don't take that on me, because I... It's like, I don't even know if he's going to bring the gifts over. Not that I care about that, honestly. Not that I care about that. But I don't know if he's going to bring the gifts over or not. I don't know if he's, like, still going to come. If anything, I'll have to call Grandma and just be like, Hey, uh, I'm sorry I didn't uh, get a chance to talk to you. Or, like, wish you a Merry Christmas. It's just, I've had a lot going on lately around here. Um, and number two, my... 
like my mom told you, my phone is uh, acting up, so that's the reason why I couldn't be able to make a call. Alright guys, I'm going to get out of here. Uh, the only thing I can say right now is... Like, subscribe, favorite, follow me on everything. And I wish you all a Merry Christmas. Well, sorry, Merry Belay Christmas. And a Happy Fucking New Year. And peace.